This is why. <laughs> I try not to come to places like this on a Saturday. There's lots of parties. And my shoe broke. <laughs> we, <laughs> we're supposed to get like crazy thunderstorms today. Here. You didn't have fun. What do you mean you didn't have fun? <laughs> yeah, the, but, yeah boy, the boys were kind of playing a little rough. Come here. What do you mean you didn't have fun? You were yelling at me that you didn't want to leave. Right? <laughs> I know. Uh, I think you're just kind of cranky, to be honest with you. I don't think, I think somebody... <laughs> I don't, I think somebody needed a nap today and we didn't take one. Um, but my stupid shoe, I was in the bathroom with Ella and I stepped on my shoes just the right way and I snapped it and I'm wearing sandals. So it's holding on by a flipping thread, but hold on, I don't even remember where we parked. Oh, it's behind us. Okay. Hold on real quick. Um, <laughs> so we went and visited daddy at lunch. And then we came here because it was supposed to rain and it hasn't yet. We went to the store and got this weird toys play. Okay. We got this and we got this. So, so today is a hot one, so we're gonna try to play with our pool. But yeah, I don't and know. I got and our fishes. Yeah, we got these magnetic let me see. These magnetic fishes as well. Um, the only problem is I don't know if I can blow this up manually or not, so we might have to go to the store. But that's what we're about to find out. The last two days we've been having thunderstorms. I bought this on, I think, Friday. And today's Monday, so she's been patiently waiting to use it. Actually, this is the thing I got um, from, I believe, our last vlog. And I got this. It's really hot because it's hot out. Uh, no. Yeah, it's hot out. Already hot out. Oh, It's about 11. Okay, there's some. Wait, hold on, there's hold on, because I don't want to lose all the pieces yet. So hold on. I got all. So. Oh, I have five balls. One, two, three. Four. Okay, yeah, we can take the balls out here. I'll, I'll toss them. Oop. But we'll put that in the pool when it's ready. So it comes with five little balls. Oh, here's one. Boop. One little piece. Oh, six balls. And then. Okay, the pool itself. So let me see. And, and God, I can't. I gotta wait for my mom and get some water. What about the hose? Yeah, honey, I think I'm gonna need a uh, um a blower thing because I don't think this has like manual. Oh, ah, lots of ants. Go away. Um, I don't think this has like one of those manual pumps at least from the direction so let's um spread it out take a look at it oh here's a giraffe but, yeah unfortunately i think we're gonna have to run to this store which is fine but all right what the heck is this i think that's the water spray oh it does have a manual one. Oh, it has a lot of manual ones okay i'm gonna attempt <laughs> to blow this up um here is like if you have a <sighs> to make it like easy but you know your girl doesn't so we're gonna try it let me dad mom can i open this yet not yet babe because i don't want to lose the pieces yet when the pool is filled up with water and ready to go then we'll open that can you please excuse me yeah so i'm gonna try again try to blow this up as best as i can if i start getting lightheaded <laughs> then we're just gonna head to the store oh wait here's a giraffe yeah, the giraffe has one too i know my main concern is this big bottom portion down here, which now looking at it, I don't think, I don't think the bottom part, sugar, I don't think the bottom part has a manual valve. I think just the little like pieces. So I think we're going to have to go to the store, sweetie, because I can't blow this up without a pump. So we'll be back. All right, round number two. We are back from the store. We got ourselves a little air pump. To be as honest, it's a manual one. I'm not. I'm not that worried about. It. Okay, so here we are. 
seems simple enough. Um, we got a hose with three different sized nozzles, so it seems that I would just. Um, Wait, let's touch it here. All right, let's um. Is so it? Start. Is it working? Alright, I feel like oops, I feel I feel like one way is in and one way is out, so whoops, maybe I have to have it attached on this side. Let's see. Oh yeah. That's better. definitely blowing up here. I just want to um, spread it out a bit more. Like so. Ah, the monkey's under it. It's fine. I'll get him after. And he's blown. We threw the giraffe away. I got the giraffe. The giraffe came and it threw it away. Here's the monkey. There we go. do that real fast. <laughs> Whew, okay, got the big part done. I think the rest of it can be done manually, but we'll see. So I think the pool itself is officially blown up. Obviously, I got little pieces, so let's go put it where it needs to go. Nightmare, but we we're able to get it hooked up. What the heck is it leaning over like that for? Okay, he got. Catching anything? Hey, that's cheating. I got one. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, you gotta you reel it the other way, baby. I'm doing it. You there you go. go. Woo! We're having fish tonight for dinner. <laughs> Whoops! It's so stinking hot out today. <laughs> Actually, yesterday. Oh, I got something in my eye. Yesterday happened to even be hotter. Wow, well, I got something in my eye. Yesterday, I think, got up to like 93. Today, Hi, I mean, it's 88. I Hi, got babe. these two new horses and two of these horns just broke. And they're the same Did problem. both of the horns break? Yeah. What? Yeah. I thought only one broke. <laughs> what happened to the other one? I, I got two. Oh my goodness. Well, today we just got some chores done this morning. It's noon now, so we're on our way to go get some lunch. Um, but I'm pretty excited. I am sweating. I am absolutely sweating. I just like mowed the lawn. <sighs> it's very All hot. day long. Yes. Um, I'm still dealing with this gigantic rash on my leg and I know that's like so random and maybe I should just save the update for pregnancy diaries but it's like so and itchy so if you see me like a beauty oh doesn't have stop. Nuts. so beauty doesn't have those pieces under her belly with Skyler does um yeah for some reason the horses have genitalia anyways um <laughs> I'm actually really excited because <laughs> We are not going to get a donut. We're on our way to go get lunch. Which place are we going? <laughs> We're gonna go to Papagino's. They have, I'm craving pizza for some reason. Well, actually, I had pizza the other night. No, they don't have white pizza there, but they do have white pasta. So I'm gonna get you white pasta. She only eats Alfredo pizza. Will not have tomato pizza at all. Um, but I'm really craving the pizza and I know that they have something there that she'll like so um, That's what we're off to do right now. I'm very excited because we're doing something different tonight that we haven't really done uh, We're going camping just for today happens to be July 3rd um, We're going on the fourth for, for the third and the fourth. We're going up to my aunt's 
campground. Um, again, just for tonight. So we're leaving later tonight. So I have a lot of packing to do. Actually, I just bought her a, um, I didn't even show you this, but I bought you a life jacket, bub. So I don't know what kind of like swimming there will be there, but I'm assuming there might be like a lake of some sort. So um, I needed one anyways for the summer. So, oh my gosh, this AC needs to get colder. <laughs> um, so we're going up there, but like my whole family is going, like my aunt who owns the campground, her family, my other aunts, um, then my, you know, mom, my brothers, uh, Amber, Ella, me, TJ is going to go up tomorrow morning because I think it's a two hour trip. We're going up to Maine and by the time he comes up, up to work, I'm like, you're going to get there when we're sleeping anyways. So I said, just stay at home, sleep. Feed arrow in the morning and then come right up first thing. So we'll see him tomorrow morning. Oh, it is so itchy. But next week we're also TJ has some time off, so we're also planning on going up to a different campground for like three nights. So that should be really fun. And like we never do stuff like that as a family, and we want to start creating like a annual tradition. So if we like this campground. <laughs> just itching um if we like this campground then we want to make like a trip every year to go up for like a week or something so that should be fun i will talk to you guys in a little bit probably when we're kind of more situated in packing uh but yeah it should be fun okay. so we just finished up lunch uh i got some pizza pizza which was satisfying um but it's funny though because I've been trying to stay away from like soda and I've been doing really really good because I felt like it was having a big impact on my um mm. hold on hold on it's very busy we're in a liquor parking lot as well the day before the fourth so I'm trying not to hit you see me backing up lady what do you think's gonna happen <laughs> Um, yeah, busy parking lot, hang on. If you see me looking here, by the way, I have a backup camera. Okay, um, so, I've been trying to stay away from soda because I felt like it was having a huge impact on my morning sickness. Now my morning sickness, um, it's actually eased up a lot. Um, I haven't been drinking soda at all this week. I've been staying away from like 99% of sweets. I think the only sweet thing that I had was like literally one little sugar cookie. Why did I just run? Oh, it was a pothole thing. Um, Me too, I had a sugar. Yeah, like she had the sugar, it's like it was a pack of three. So I gave her the other sugar cookies and I had like half of one. Excuse me. So I've been doing really good, but when I was eating that pizza, I'm like, oh man. You know what would go real good with this right now? It's a Coke. So I had some. So we'll see. Was that a bad idea? I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. Um, but that's the only like soda that I'm going to have um, all this week. I've been drinking nothing else but watermelon, water, lemonade, hello, and water. Um, but right now, we've also, just this morning, I assigned... Um, I created a Facebook event for her birthday party, which we're having, we're having her, so her birthday is on August 31st, and we usually have a party, like, on the same weekend or a couple days, like, right around her birthday. So her birthday happens to fall on a Sunday this year, but my sister-in-law is also pregnant, one of TJ's sisters, and the only day that, like, her the guy that she's with the only day that he could get his entire family happened to be on August 31st so she talked to us and she's like I know it's on her birthday is that okay I said that's fine like we'll just do it um you know we'll we'll plan a week before we'll do her, her birthday a week before and then like we'll have a cake at the uh what is it baby shower too so a baby show to get you new for, baby for, <laughs> for for Dithi Lexi we're gonna have she has a baby shower remember she's gonna have a baby before I have a baby um so, so two sisters well her baby will be your cousin and it's a boy um 
so anyways, long story short, we're having her birthday a week before her birthday party, a week before her actual birthday, which is fine. But I just, I just created the event today and I started inviting, like it's gonna be small, like I'm just inviting family. I kill myself every year trying to throw this big thing for her birthday and then like not everybody shows up and then I have a huge mess in my house and it's just like so extremely stressful. So I'm, I'm like this year I wanna keep it simple. Um, I just wanna keep it simple. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have it at like, I haven't 100% decided on the location yet but we're just gonna do it at a public park. Um, so this morning is uh, along with creating the birthday event. I've also gone on Amazon and starting like putting together things in my cart that we're gonna need. And we're not gonna need a ton, but I'm just gonna make cupcakes this year. My, my, I'm gonna call her my sister-in-law, but like my brother's girlfriend, they've been together forever. So my sister-in-law and my mom are gonna help me put the cupcakes together. But I know I have like plates and napkins. I'm gonna do a birthday haul too. I love doing that. That's like one of my annual videos I love doing every year. But I'm like so stressed out because I'm still trying to do a back to school giveaway. I'm trying to do like back to school makeup. I'm trying to do um, like, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> and then I want to do like a, like a back to school for her too. But kindergarten, they really don't need anything. So I don't really think that's going to be a video until next year. But I'm still trying to put together two backpacks to give away this year. So there's been a lot going on. And uh, time is, is slipping away very quickly. So, basically, I'm going to be going on... Uh, we're going to go to Target because it's one of those days that it's almost too hot to do something outside. We're going to go to Target and see... I'm going to, like, pull up my Amazon cart and see if we can just, like, buy anything there. Maybe at a cheaper price or maybe something that I like better. Um, and then we'll, we'll kind of go from there. I'm just trying to trying to find stuff to kill time so that's what we're gonna do right now but I need to go home I have like a little birthday fund going on that I don't have with me so I have to go home and get that real quick but we're gonna we're gonna stop there and see if we find anything so far we've had a bit of luck honestly yeah, I really got oh, yeah that was pretty cool I mean we're still gonna do like a haul on all this stuff so we found a couple and sort of like party favors stuff it right here <laughs> yeah um i also found some candles and i only need i wanted candles like this but maybe a smaller pack but i don't see a smaller pack but we are also gonna need these I'll grab some of these while we're here it's so flipping busy here today um and it's weird it's a wednesday I'm trying to find oh, i never come to target for food i'm trying to find like their baking stuff. Let's see what I can find. Oh, hey mom. Funfetti. Yeah, but good. coloring because I'm just gonna do white frosting and then dye them. So with that being said, I also need just vanilla, I guess. <laughs> okay. some fan oh <laughs> yeah. I think okay. two should be fine. I think I've done all the Hi guys. shopping I can do so, here. I think so. the rest of it is going to be ordered online. So, what is you to put the, something you to put the Oh my gosh. I almost just like T boned this lady. Oh my gosh. I felt so bad. So, like, we're put. I have. Okay. I've been in a couple accidents in my life, but they've never been my fault. I got T boned once and I've been rear ended twice. And. I swear, I did not see this car. It was like this weird, like you could take a left or a right and there was an SUV on the left and I was trying to take a right and I like pulled up and I swear I was looking and I'm like, I don't see a car coming. So I pull out and all of a sudden this red car is there and I'm like, oh. so I slammed on my brake. I felt so bad. I ended up pulling up. We both pulled up to a light, but then I was taking a left and she was going straight and I pulled up next to her and I'm like, I'm so sorry. I'm like, I'm like, I felt so bad. That would have been, oh, that would have been awful. That would have not.
yeah, not been so. fun. Was... My heart is pounding out of my chest. That was so flippin' scary. And she was driving a red car. Like, I did not see that. She must have been perfectly in a blind spot. Oh my goodness, my heart is pounding out of my chest. Oh, okay. <laughs> we dodged that bullet. Holy smokes. Like she didn't even she didn't even see it. I was just like, I'm so sorry. Mm, my goodness, I felt oh thank god I didn't give her a heart attack or something. I gave myself a heart attack. That was so scary. But we're all good. We're all good. We we avoided that. Oh wow, that was scary. You wanna get your heart pumping? Holy smokes. Smoke Olies, let me know. Yeah, I mean, yeah. it's so difficult for you guys to reach out to me, but if you can, let me know if you've ever had like an incident like that where like maybe you've been the cause of an accident or like almost was an accident. Like, what happened? Because I literally did not see that car. I was like, I'm good to go. And I've been driving, I mean, I'm 26 and I got my license, well, I got my permit at 15. I've been driving 11 yeah, years yeah. and I've yeah. never been in an accident. So, I'm a good driver, I swear. That was just, that was the closest call that I've had that was would have been my fault. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that, that scared me. That's oh my, girl, you didn't even see 